insane, man. Like, let's <clears throat> Rakdos mid range and Pioneer. Hope you guys are excited for it. I know I am, at least for the time being. Uh, like I said, my name's Lance. More probably my screen name is Major Riot. That's Major underscore Riot underscore. That is my screen name on Twitch, YouTube, MTGO, MTGA, and Twitter. So watch this live on Twitch. If you're following, watch this on YouTube. Please you're subscribing to this video, a thumbs up. And you can also follow me on Twitter for reasons unknown. That's right. Follow Major Riot on Twitch and Twitter. And don't forget to subscribe to Major Riot on YouTube. For the low, low cost of free. Don't delay doing it now for a guaranteed outburst of rage, confusion, and even sometimes joy. Um, you know, I always have a disclaimer, though, of course. I am not responsible for sun increased to top, and top decking only lands, being wrecked by Ragaman, or being unable to find your sideboard cards. If that starts happening to you, it has nothing to do with me. So I put that out there right now. Dude. Hey. Um, but as you can tell, I do enjoy playing Magic the Gathering, although I watch my videos, you may never know that. And when I do play Magic the Gathering, I prefer to play whatever the RCQ season is. Now, I know it's modern RCQ, so when I do playing Pioneer, well, there are no RCQs for me to attend this weekend. There are literally zero. It's a blank weekend, which is fine with me, because I'm always more than happy to, uh, you know, kind of get away from the One Ring and kind of just the endless Boros energy versus Eldrazi Tron or Mirror Match thing, you know. It, it, it's Modern's pretty stale, in my opinion. Um, but Pioneer, we're here, and uh, I'll talk about this deck in a second. Uh, let's take a look at the weather. It's a wonderful fall day, which means, for me, it's wet. Uh, weather right now good are cloudy. The temperature is 56 degrees. The wind is blowing from the west at 1 miles per hour, and the current humidity is 95%. So there you go. Weather for your friend. Major riot. Uh, let's take a look here. We're still 53 followers on Twitter. So 353 followers on Twitch. We did go up three subscribers on YouTube. We're now at 618. So thank you guys very, very much there. So of course you know what I gotta do. Shouts all 53 followers on Twitter. Shouts all 353 followers on Twitch. Shouts all 618 subscribers on YouTube. Of course, a massive shout out to all three of my Twitch subscribers. Gonna be a little bit of the hard money. These very trying and dangerous times. I really appreciate it. it's going way above beyond the call of duty. Obviously, you can spend the money anywhere else and make a lot more sense than here. I think anybody who watches this live on Twitch or record on YouTube, I've always had a particularly massive, robust, adult-style shout-out for those who are willing to contribute financially. Thank you so very, very much. All right, so Rakdos mid-range. Uh, of course, obviously, vampires have been banned, or Soren and Imperius Blood. And, uh, you know, I, I think I played a league uh, a couple weeks ago with Rakdos mid-range. didn't have any shoulders in it, but it had an ar archery in the draw. So it was still pretty good. You know, I, I think that I would have preferred couple Shialards in there, but overall, I thought the deck was still quite good. Uh, today, I'm going to try out the new cards. Uh, what am I talking about here? Well, I'll show you a couple of them. There's Blazemire Verge, uh, a new land from Dustmorn. It says tap, add black, tap, add red, act villain if you control a swamp or a mountain. No swamps, or no mountains in here. There are three swamps, and of course, an Urborg. Uh, four Mutavolts, I'll get to that in a second. Um, we're looking at here, here's a new card. Fear of missing out. When fear of missing out enters, discard a card, then draw a card. Delirium, whenever fear of missing out attacks for the first time each turn, if there are four more card types among cards in your graveyard, untap target creature. After this phase, there's an additional combat phase. Um, very important that it's not an additional main phase. I've seen people try that with cards like this. Um, so we'll see how that goes. I mean, it's pretty good. You know, if, if you top deck this, you could top deck another card, I would assume. Uh, I would assume it works like Season Pyromancer and Bedlam Reveler. Or if you have no cards at hand, you just draw a card. Um, so, I don't know. I I guess we'll find out. Unstoppable Slasher uh, is a 2 and a black for a 2-3 with Death Touch. Whenever an Unstoppable Slasher co deals combat damage to a player, they lose half their life and round it up. When Unstoppable Slasher dies, they have no counters on it. Return to the battlefield, tap it under controller with two stun counters on it. So it doesn't die, technically. It comes back. Um, Arch me the draws you guys have seen. Uh, this new card, Unholy Annex and Ritual Chamber. I've been playing this in standard in Golgari mid-range. It's been putting in work. Um, so the Unholy Annex, two and a black. At the beginning of your end step, draw a card. If you control a demon, each one loses two life, and you gain two life. Otherwise, you lose two life. Supple Slasher is, or Archfiend of the Dross is a demon. And then uh, Ritual Chamber, three and a black. When you can unlock this door, create a 6-6 six, six black demon creature token with flying. So you can pay eight mana, and you get to make a 6-6 six, six and draw a card, and your opponent loses two life, and you gain two life. So it is a big swing, kind of, sort of. Um, sideboard... Most of the cards you guys have seen before, Anoint with Affliction, I brought in for, um, you know, I would assume, uh, you know, there we go, for an Oculus or the Eye Monster, which I cannot beat in standard. That thing's so good. 
And a couple Anger of the Gods. Uh, funny story about Anger of the Gods. I'm sure this story has been told before, but I need to tell it again because it's been a while. This card is the reason I was banned in the Pawns of Discord. Um, we were running this card on the sideboard. I think it's a really good card still. Um, the guy who drew this artwork, uh, I guess, was allegedly uh, on Twitter, was accused of beating women or something. So I had no idea what was going on. I showed up at like 3 in the morning in the Discord, and everybody's saying how this card... No one should be running it and everything, and I didn't know what was going on. And I said, well, I'm not going to get rid of this card. I like this card a lot, and I got banned. And they banned me, and I got an angry message from the mod Discord, uh, or the mod on that Discord saying that I'm a, like a, I, I'm okay with abusing women and children and stuff. It was ridiculous. Uh, but anyways, that was many years ago, but still, go fuck yourself, that mod, whoever that was. Uh, and then uh, Invoke Despair just brought in just kind of as a, Weeper card, basically. So let's go on in there. Not really else to say. See how the new cards do. You know, I'm a little concerned about it. There's not enough uh, removal. Like, you know, I like having a bunch of, you know, like go for the throats and stuff like that. So hopefully um, I won't be like, oh my God, I need more removal. But we'll see. Of course, the tower for the like, Phoenix. Um, and uh, the old bargain mechanic on it's probably not as good. You know, because there's no uh, blood tokens from Blood Tide Harvester. Um, but I'm looking forward to the next upcoming standard season. I've been enjoying Golgari Midrange. I've been working on it, you know, offline. Or not really offline, but, you know, not for the camera. Not for you fine folk watching. But um, been working on it and finding stuff. And uh, here we go. All righty. Well, before I fish, I decided to go first with the my beer today. And, folks, it's a good one. What am I talking about here? I'm talking about a 12 ounce can of Mountain Dew voltage. That's right. Buzz, buzz. Uh, we got some voltage here. Uh, we all know the official start video is beginning. I crack on my beer. It's going to happen right now. Here we go. <clears throat> yes. Oh, yeah. All right, I'm ready. Yeah, let's go first. Five lands. I think I can do better, maybe. I hope so. One land, and it's a den of the bugbear. This is starting out great. Going to five. All right, there we go. There we go. A little bit better here. Keep. I guess what Mutavault and Arch being the dross on the bottom. I'll lead off with Blaze Mire. Oh. Okay. Well, shit. Guess I'll be taking that rattle chains. Two Mausoleum Wanderers, great. Don't think I'll be winning this one. Mmm. Wonderful. Oh, he doesn't want to play more ghosts here. What can I tell you guys?
All right. Um, let's see here. Um, oh, what do we need here? I think Anger of the Gods is probably good. Um, Annoy of the Affliction is probably all right. Uh, probably don't need to rest. Um, maybe one of these. I mean, I could try. I think I don't think a Desigu is good enough, right? Because most of their creatures are two mana, right? Except for like Spectral Sailor. So, yeah, we'll go with that. Uh, all right, let's see if I can do something a little bit better. Yeah, there we go. A lot better. All right. Getting in there. During Innocence. What is this? Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, I'll take Mosling Wanderer. Um, what do we want to discard here? Uh, I guess we can do Unstoppable Slash. Oh, I'm going to attack. I mean, yeah, he'll just block it, but... but yeah, all right. Protection from vampires, okay. They must say no. I, I like all the cards in my hand here. Um, I'm just going to anoint with Affliction. Yeah. Let's go Thoughtseize here. Oh my god, I think I did that wrong. I forget how this thing fucking works. Um... Yeah, I think I like taking away Enduring in a sense, even though, yeah, we'll do that. Um,
Do a mana count. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we're going to go... Ritual Chamber and make the 6-6 six, six Demon. Yeah, on, on Empty Joe, you got to look down at the thing and see what side they're catching. It doesn't tell, oh, I guess it does. It, okay, well, that, he's still, it, it's still tough. Wow, he did not. He did not stop that. I thought he tried to. Ah. Rattly chains. So we know he's got We know he's got Spell Queller and um, the one creature, uh, Mausoleum Wanderer. Do I just want to kill this now? Perhaps. I mean, none of them have... The only thing I'm concerned about is he, he somehow gets, like, Flash. Yeah, I'm going to kill this thing now. Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, I guess instead, Fatal Push kills the Mausoleum Wanderer. So I guess it's kind of the same thing. Okay, well, whatever. I got one card out of his hand. All right, we know they still got the... Uh, Spell Queller. I'll draw a card and gain two life. That's what I figured would happen. I mean, 100%. Unbelievable draw. Unbelievably bad draws. Yeah, I, I can't I can't do anything. Wow. I have to basically hope that I find off the top here. I need to find some off this 
to kill one of these. A fatal push. <sighs> but anything. I'm looking at if I swing with the goblin, I'll get another treasure token. But then I won't be able to block that as easily. So I'll get another goblin off this. Um, yeah, let's just swing here. All right, it comes down to uh, what the top of my deck has. Now yeah, I lose. Man, I guess maybe I should take out the thought seizes. Oh wow. Isn't that late? I blocked. That's three, five, six. Oh, I guess I miscounted. I guess I miscounted. All right, now I have delirium. Play another ritual chamber. I'm going to find out if this thing works the way I think it does. Ah, I just draw a car. Right on. Okay. Um, that was a good one. Um, this has to attack to cause this to untap. So, all right, opponent just gives up. I wish opponent would have done that. I want to try and figure this out. Like, I'm sorry I'm playing slow, but I need to figure out these new cards. So this would have attacked, this would attack. Then I could have untapped this. And there could have been a second attack with this. Yeah, I apologize to the opponent for me taking so long. I mean, I gotta figure this stuff out. You know, it's not it's not easy. I guess I miscounted luckily for myself there. I thought I was dead. But I was not dead. Kind of a slow hand, probably not good enough. I need to have something. There we go. That's a little bit better. Play the one that can't be killed by uh Torch Tower, that's fine. I think I may lose to land issues again. Just uh maybe I'll push that now.
Yeah, looking like lands are going to be a problem for both players, but he's got flash creatures, so... Um, he might be okay here. Yeah, he didn't there. All right, now he's ready with Spell Quellers. Yeah, oh my god, <laughs> 26 land deck. You know, so yeah, here we go. Uh, game's over, I can't compete now. Just, you know, what a weird match. I guess we're just gonna hang out here and I'll have to discard the hand size pretty soon. Yep, discarding the hand size, sweet, fuck yeah. Um, which one I want to get rid of? I guess Unstoppable Slasher, I don't know. There we go, there's a land. Alright, I guess we just hang out, wait for him to do something. Who's gonna make the first move? Yeah, I did not see that coming. Well, I didn't expect him to do that. I guess I'll take two, I don't know. Yeah, he's probably not gonna play another spell for the rest of the game. You know, I'm sure it's just nothing but uh, counter spells from the rest of the game. So this is over. I'm not going to be able to beat this. Sad. Concede and give up. You know, I mean, just deck did not perform. Deck did not perform. Uh, yeah, I can't even win here because of yeah, my life. Non-game. I mean, I don't know how to tell you guys. There's another non-match here. Um, yeah, I just couldn't play the game. Couldn't play the game at all. Not going to win. You can't play the game.
I'm not gonna win, you can't play the game. I'm not gonna win, you can't play the game. You're not gonna win, we can't play the game. You're not gonna win, you can't play the game. You're not gonna win. You can't play the game. Okay? Like I, I just I don't know what I could have done differently there. I guess keep all lands. I guess that's what I need to do with this deck. I forget how this thing works. I've been playing modern. Is you just you don't ever take away your lands. Just like in standard. You're like, hey, five land hand, keep it. You know. Just, you know, you think you draw lands once in a while. You know, I'm I'm known for drawing lands, but apparently not enough there. Yeah, I'll keep. Is it Grease Fang? Yeah, it looks like a grease thing. Go toss the second unholy annex. No, no vehicles went in, so that's good. We grab Blooming Marsh. There's one. Kind of weak as you draw a card at the end of your turn. It's probably a grease thing here. Well, when I played this deck, I just I could not get this. Like literally, the card just just like didn't exist. Do you guys remember how insane that was? Wow. I mean, a weird trick here I think you can do is you play this
and then you go tap this then you go end step i think this works yes it did okay cool Yeah. You got it. Probably, I don't know. I, mean, he, I, I doubt he'll take Fatal Push. Yeah. Well, one card in hand is, uh, you got Can't Stay Away or something? Oh, no, just a Grease Wing. Yeah, it's not doing me a lot of good here. No, I'm going to try this too. I've never done this either. Play a second one. And just throw out lands. Well, I mean, I did four damage to him. I'm at 12. That It doesn't have haste anymore. Mm-hmm. That was actually dangerous of me to put it in on, uh, uh, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I guess it's all right. I don't have Bone Crusher Giant anymore. I keep thinking like I have Bone Crusher. Put him down at two. I'll go up to sixteen. Man, that's a lot of lands. All right, so if we cruise this up, that's six damage. All right, Whew. wow, that worked really good. That was a lot better than I thought it would be. The Muta Vault. Being the demon every turn for the two unholy annexes. That's awesome. All right. Uh, let's see here. Let's get unlicensed Hurson. 
Uh, go blanks are generally all right. Um, of course, the tower's got to be bad here. Um, molten collapse. Uh, got to be bad. <laughs> that just cannot be good. It's sorcery speed against this deck. Um, you know, I wouldn't mind annoy the affliction. Just because of, uh, you know, you can exile, uh, what's his name? Trees Fang. Um, but I think that might be just too much. Um, I think Duress, Duress can be fine. Maybe I should take an Unstoppable Slasher. I'm kind of so-so on this thing, Unstoppable Slasher. I, I mean, it's fine, but I don't know. It doesn't seem as good as... I, I think it's mostly for that combo with the Bloodler Alka, Al, uh, Alcatraz. Um, man. I got a Duress. I guess. Fatal Push definitely isn't as good as it was in the old Rakdos because I don't have blood tokens. Uh, sure. This will work. Like, I'm sure it'll be amazing when I hit them. This does, like, 12, right? It takes them to 18, and then they lose half. They go to 8. So they gotta, they gotta, I mean, I, I can see why it's good. But it, it just seems like, well, we'll just kill that thing before. And it does not, it, it, it is tough to kill. If it came back with one stun counter, then I'd be like, wow, that's pretty good. But two stun counters? It does survive Fatal Push, as I sadly found out. When I last played Rakdos, I, I didn't think it was... I'm so used to bigger stats on creatures, uh, for low mana creatures, that I was like, oh, that's a two drop. Because you think of, like, you know, uh, the uh, that uh, the fear of missing out. It's a two, three for two mana. Moss with Dread Knight's a three, two for two. Um, Blood Tide Harvester's a three, two for two. You know, there's just... Uh, a lot of cards, you know, that fit that criteria, and for some reason it's kind of an older one where it it just it it's big but not big, you know. All right, well, an Urborg. I think I'll hold off on giving him swamp just right this moment. Yeah, I don't think this card's quite as good as Grizzly Salvage. The only way I think it's better is that now we can grab this Bank Buster, right? Grizzly Salvage is going to grab lands and creatures, so this can grab any permanent. Yeah, I chose Bank Buster. I mean, he'll always take this card from me, so it's got to be doing something, right? Okay, now I'm getting a lot of mutable. Why did I just play another mutable? That was stupid. Oh well. Dare to be stupid. Dare to be stupid. Gotta get this Archfiend of the Dross in there. Start swinging for six a, six a turn. More lands. Oh, 
Oh, they don't have Heartless Act. Well, they didn't have it. Well, they might still. Ooh, more lands. God damn, I need those. Yeah, I'll fire one up. Why not? I've only got a bajillion lands here. All right, down it goes. He knows about Heartless Act, right? I guess he just wanted that to get out of my hand. That's all of them, baby. Um, oh my god, the wrong one. How the fuck does that shit still happen to me? Oh well. Oh wait, you know what? Oh, I can't tap it now. There's a fucking creature. How's that shit still happen to me? I'm sure I'm not the only one that happens to. Um, I should have played Urborg. Excuse me. All right. So he should be at 12, not 14, but whatever i've only drawn lands guys i don't know if you've noticed this but so far remember that one i lost to the spirits i didn't draw any lands now i've only drawn lands i mean we're gonna have a muta vault fucking like jamboree coming pretty soon i mean look at this show me a second different other grease thing And we were, oh, I'm going to hit him for eight here, I hope. I'm going to do it. Mm, maybe not that much now. Um, Hell yeah. Hell yeah. All right, we'll volt push the uh, grease fang. Oh, I guess that's just not really going to help that much either. I think it's possible for me to find a way to kill grease fang too. I 
I think it's better to have them tap out to play this than just, you know, if I kill this and I do nothing, somehow I draw even more lands. I think it's best just to kill Grease Fang. Yeah. Maybe I can find Thought Caesar Duress, too. Well, I wish I would have killed a, a, the, uh, a different card now. Okay. Well, we got stuff maybe going here. How much mana do I have? One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I can do the whole thing here. Ritual Chamber. Okay. He should probably still play the chariot just because it'll just put more cats on the board for him. Like, I really don't know what would be the negative to that. I mean, if he's thinking about, like, you know, because now he's just stuck in this thing. I don't think he has, I mean, he certainly have enough land room to kill four mutavolts. So I'm just going to be drawing an extra card every turn while he, I'm going to be gaining two, like, he's going to be draining, getting drained by two. So I, I, I don't know. Yeah, abrupt decay. All right. Fair enough. Only comes in with one kitty. Nice. How much that man did I say I have? Eight. And clearly, I think I just need to cast Archfiend. That's red alert time. I probably should have done Go Blink first. What do you discard? Reckoner, Bankbuster, and Bitter Triumph. That can't be good. Discards Bitter Triumph. All right, we're going to be in a little bit of a racing situation here. Well, that was a horrible draw. We should unlock it again. Like, what's back in that door again? Um...
Dude, yeah. Please. For the love of God. Well, he didn't have to do that. He could just crude here. Just take the four? I mean, this is getting nuts. Wow. Throwing like complete ass here. Well, that's why I used the rest, not thought so. Um. Okay, then. I mean, what the fuck? <laughs> Dude, I I have no idea what's happening here. All right, here we go. All right. That's awesome.
Discarded. Parhelion 2. Great. I'm really glad they did that. Holy crap, man. That's a close call. No, that's stupid. Let's not do that that way. I still might need these guys to block. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, fifteen. Not quite enough yet. Yes! Oh, there were creatures! Where are they at? I mean, there they start coming a little bit. Oh, wow. Uh, so you just went off the drain. You just, just beat opponents by draining them to death with... Muta Vaults. That's a pretty interesting way to play this deck, but I guess that's how you get your wins. Wow. All right, well, shit. Sure. That's a little bit different. I mean, so far I've, I've liked the deck, the new changes. Um, there's some that are a little bit different, you know. Like, again, a Supple Slasher has done, like, almost nothing. I mean, it actually has done nothing. Oh, <clears throat> uh, yeah, I can't argue with that. It's pretty good. Oh, boy. Blue Eye Control, bro. Hot diggity dog. Yeah, I'll shock and shock again. That's what we do. Uh. Uh. <laughs> I, I think I'm just going to take the Wandering Emperor. Like, that's by far the best card in the guy's hand. Like, he's not going to. Be mana screwed. Oh, it resolved. Nice. This is always a weird thing in Magic, right? Where you look at this and you're like, well, I shouldn't play into this, but I have nothing else to do. You know what I'm saying? Like, I literally have nothing else I can do. So, like, and this Fatal Push is probably not going to do much in this game. Um, so do I just take this from their hand, basically? Like, I do, like, Unstoppable Slasher becomes Thought Seize and I target No More Lies? I mean, you just, I guess, I mean, I don't know. Maybe it's bad gameplay. I don't know. Like, it's just, it's always something where it's just, well, what do you do? Uh, I would really, oh, I quit drawing, quit drawing lands. 
That would be very helpful and awesome. All right, let's use this Field of Ruin, I guess. What's the word on this? Three. I'll take that. Well, he got some action there. He didn't play a land, so that's actually good yet bad. Oh, the game's over. Oh, who else is bored? I know I'm bored. Fuck yeah. Oh, I did that.
Look at that, made it on the field. Wow. That's something different. Oh, yeah, this is an artifact. Oh. Huh. Well, we'll keep it from ultimating, hopefully. Okay. <laughs> Keep the game going a little bit longer, maybe. Oh, hell yeah. All right. Wow. Okay. That'd be like no more lies. But no more lies, is that two or is that three mana? I guess three. Draw only lands, you can't win. It's all lands. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven lands out of twenty cards. Yeah, more than half. Boring ass games. I mean, what can I tell you? All right, fatal pushes are out. Um, bank busters in. Um. That's probably okay. I get rid of Heartless Act. Try Go Blank and Duress. I mean, I could try Invoke Despair, but I don't really know what the Invoke Despair is. People are saying you should play it, you know, but I don't really know what it's for. Like, can I bring it in in this matchup? Five man, it's pretty unlikely that we're going to resolve. Let's try this. Uh, sure. Uh, yeah, I think I like doing this. Again, looking for another land.
Boy, that was like a wandering emperor. Doesn't it? Mm. I just attack directly into it. Hell yeah. Um, yeah, motherfucker. Yeah. 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 Now they'll play the, um... The Narset. They gotta play kind of right here. Oh. Look at that. What a fat piece of shit. Well, I guess I can swing. Yeah, I really, I think I should have discarded two cards there. And then I don't think I want to use Fear of Missing Out yet.
How do they always have fucking counters? All right, well, I can't, I can't really do anything here. You know, they're just going to use farewell. Oh, were mine just enchantments? Mine were only enchantments, weren't they? Yeah, that's an enchantment creature. Forgot about that. What do you get? March other worldly light? Yeah, I'm just dead. All right. Ugh. Absolutely anally raped. Like, I just... I can't play either one of these cards. You know? I, I just... I can't. Fear of being fucked in the ass without permission. That's particularly disturbing. I can't play these fear of missing out it's because of the Narset. Like it's just like I literally can't. I have to discard them and then, you know, I I just I can't win the game. Like I fought them to like almost kind of a draw, but you know, it just wasn't good enough. Not good enough. I can't defeat Narset. Like uh, if I if I can just get one. Thing to do anything, you know? It's not gonna let me look. Yeah, I don't know. It's another bad example of uh, of um, you know, bullshit happening to me. You know. Blue light control supposed to be the best deck in Pioneer now, isn't it? What happened? What card did they get? Is that just that one creature from Bloomboro? Is that it? I don't I don't know. No idea. Not a clue. Every day we be fucking. Uh, sure. Be a, oh, this is probably that Rakdos uh, aggro. Okay. Let's find out. Oh, it's that tree card.
Only land so far. Gotta love that. All right. Yeah, I guess I'll toss this basic swamp. Get another two for two land. Yeah. That's all about right there. It is getting none but lands. My god. This is the way magic was intended. I have four card types now. I mean, what do you even do? You know, you got, you got the car. You get, I mean, so like, if I attack with fear missing out, I don't know, I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try and swing with bolt and see what happens. He has right now. He can't get delirium. I guess just do it again. I mean, because he can block and they'll trade, I guess. I mean, I don't know. All right. I want to see how that worked. Uh, most of these cards I've never, well, the creatures I've never played. Um, well, some of them. Once he finds that third land, it's probably just done, right? That is a fat ass defender 13. Yeah, there it is. Yeah. Now we're busy. All right, time to see if I can draw something other than lands, right? Like, you know, uh, just about anything here. No. No. Zero. Absolutely not happening. <laughs> you can't make this shit up, guys. You simply cannot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 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 more than half. I 
I guess I should have attacked there twice. That discard is tree? Yeah, so. So many lands today. Like, what is happening, man? What is happening? Yeah, I definitely think I need to put a Hive of the Eye Tyrant in here. I, I think that, you know, something's clearly wrong. Um... Yeah, I don't know. I don't have a clue what's going on. I was having so many sweet cards. I just daydream about these you know, some days. Someday I'm gonna do something sweet. Just you wait and see. There we go. And now we got something to maybe do. Fatal Push and Takanuma? Why would they get rid of Fatal Push? It's pretty good. Uh. Nobody wants to move in? What's going on? Okay, I, I don't know. Yeah. What is going on? I just have to attack here. Back again. Sure. I mean, I don't even know what to do, you know? I mean, it's like I, I cannot find things to do. 
I don't think this deck has enough creatures in it. Seems kind of bad. Like, I just, I don't have anything to ever really swing with. You know, how many I used to have? I used to have four Blood Tides, one Croxa, right? Sometimes four Bone Crushers, three. Three, um. Three, um. <clears throat> What do you get? No. Oh. Yeah, I'm not used to this combo yet. Like I always hear about it, but I rarely ever see it, but now I guess it won like RCDC, so I should be I should be more used to this now. Not really sure. Don't really know what to do. Um, license hers. Um, anger of the gods. Take the rest out. Torch the tower? I don't know. No idea. No, no, no idea. I have no idea what's going on. But I used to have how many creatures? Like 17, I think. Right? Five, four Blood Tide, one Croaks, that's five. Four Bone Crush, that's nine. Three Graveyard Trespassers. Twelve. And like two Shaldred, three Shaldred, or some sort of combination of some creatures like that. So I used to have like 15. Yeah, maybe this card isn't... Maybe I need to go back to the old style. I don't know.
That's weird. I don't know why you didn't put. I probably should have killed the, uh, attack the, uh, non-copied one. That's Anger the Gods, which could help me later. Yes. Lose two life. I'll discard anger. All right, well, let's take out Knob Nixilis here. In some life. It's a good one to discard off Nixilis if he wants to do that. He, he may have won the game already if he would have made a, a demon. A little devil. A little red devil. I don't know. Now he's just got to find a way to get rid of this Archfiend of the Draws. Your fable. Yeah, I'm not sure if this card's better or worse than Blood Tide Harvester. So far, I like Blood Tide Harvester more. I love getting that blood token. It's just so good. <laughs> it triggers Revolt Push so much easier. Um, I, I could see Unstoppable Slasher, but it's just, it's just an absolute fucking bull. I mean, people just gotta kill that thing, you know? It's like Shialdred or even Archfiend of the Dross. You know, I don't like how right now the deck, I don't have any way to fight Graveyard Hate, uh, outside of sideboarding. Um, like, I think this deck's, like, okay. 
I think it's all right. I think it could be better. Okay. What is happening here? What is going on? Okay. Wait. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's attack him. Bob Nixilis. Player. We're going to send him all at player, and he blocks, like, this one takes eight. Send them at everybody. All right, see what he's got. And can he still win here? Maybe he might still be able to win here. They can tap this, make my life total go down to four, because I'm a creature. You have a haste creature? Or like double shock? I mean, yes, oh, he's only got one card. I'm obviously not gonna, you know, do anything like that, where I'd lose my, uh, go down to two and they like lightning strike me or something. All right. Uh, I wonder if I should bring in Goblanks now. Now that I see maybe these Anger of the Gods aren't good enough. We bring in like Goblanks. I don't know. I have no idea. But yeah, I think that there's definitely something to be said about the 
Unholy Annex and the Archme of the Drosses. I just don't know if I, I prefer Fear of Missing Out. You know, I might want to just play, like, Blood Tide Harvester instead. Um, maybe, I mean, Unstoppable Slash Rev, I'm able to do anything with. Um, I think maybe I could do, like, you know, some sort of weird combination of all of them, right? Like, like you know, look in, you know, try and make the deck, you know, a little more... Like seven duresses in the main. Try um you know, just four thought seizes. And try to have more removal or more threats. Cause duress is pretty bad sometimes, like just straight up like my god, this is awful. Um but yeah, we'll see. It's an interesting game. No, he doesn't shock, so that's always good. Now it's just like, will I be able to find a land of a third land? Uh, I guess we'll take Agatha's soul. Yeah. What is he gonna play on turn two? I guess nothing. Unless he draws something here. He did. Find that land. Can't do it. Can't get there. Maybe I play this and like try to get a land. I, I I discard a card. Luckily it was a duplicate, but I still didn't get a land. So I mean, play that harvester is kind of in the same boat. Sure. Surprised you didn't attack there. Cannot get there.
very strange games. Unfucking real, man. Now I wish I had Anger of the Gods. What the fuck happened? How, how does this shit happen to me? You know what I'm saying? Like, how the, shit does, how the fuck does this shit happen to me? All the fucking time. I, mean, I just have to kill this. Pretty easy. Oh, fear missing out is also an enchantment. That's what I gotta remember. All right, there's the land. Interesting. I mean, yeah, let's see if people just freak out when they see this card. Try not to be going down to four. Wow, what a great game. <laughs> I mean, this all day, every day, I struggle with just finding things to do. No matter what deck I play, no matter what format I play, is every day I'm just like, I, I don't know what I could have done differently. I mean, I'm sure there's small things I did that were wrong. <sighs> but what, what else could I have done, you know? I mean, what else could I have done here? Yeah. 
If I would have found just another uh, fear of missing out, I may have been able to live. I don't think so. I guess I got Mutavolt here. But, I mean, just... Look how many more cards the opponent has out of their deck compared to me. Six more. You know, it's just a joke. You know, like, what the fuck happened? I don't know. I wasn't very impressed by the new cards. I just don't think they're that good. I I do like the I do like the um this thing here. This thing is sweet. I like this a lot combined with Mutavault and Archfiend of the Dross. These I just don't know. I I, I certainly think for the most part um Bloodhead Harvester is better. Like, I mean, it's just a 3-2. It makes a blood token, which makes it easier to have Revolt push. Um, I think there's just too much of this. Um, I would probably take these all out for Bloodhead Harvesters. I'd probably take out at least a couple. I might keep one or two Unstoppable Slashers in. You know, bring in, like, I don't know. Uh, um, like, uh, um, Graveyard Trespassers or Bone Crusher Giants. Definitely give a couple of Archfiend draw for bringing, like, two Shieldreds in here. I still like Shieldred a lot. Um, Probably removal will be different. I'd probably I I I don't know what I'd do here. Uh, Molten Collapse is relatively fine. Heartless Axe okay too. I'd probably take out these three. Um, maybe. Yeah, that's the problem too. Here is like what do you do like with the lands like because your lands are kind of messed up. I want to play. I want to play like um. Have the Eye Tyrant, and I think I can. I think I just go down to like one swamp again, maybe, maybe like one play like one swamp, um, and uh, something like that. Um, but yeah, I, I mean, I think it's I think it's an okay deck. I just don't think that the cards were quite as advertised. Like this is just really weird. I hate cards where it's like you know. You you have to use the discard effect whenever it comes in. Yeah, it's sweet when they when you get to do where you just draw and it's your last card in hand like a season pyromancer. That's awesome. Um, but um, I just don't know. I mean, I I really miss that blood token. That blood token's huge. Um, and and blood at heart has an amazing ability when it starts getting copied. Fear of missing out doesn't really have that great of ability. You know, I'm not that big of a fan of it. Um, also, Unstoppable Slasher, I, I don't know if I'll ever, ever be able to get the thing across. Like, I, you know, I, I just don't know. Like, I've had people do it to me, but that's me. Like, listen, you saw me lands I drew. You saw how difficult it was for me to find lands, to find the right cards at the right time. I mean, it was just impossible. And, um, you know, so you know when you play against me, you have a really good shot of having your weird combo work. But when I play it, remember I played Grease Fang, and I, I, I very rarely got the Grease Fang thing to work. My opponent got it both games. There were entire matches when I played Grease Fang where I didn't see Grease Fang once. I didn't even see the card Grease Fang, let alone have a vehicle in the graveyard. So there's some things I like about it, some things I don't like about it. Um, I'll just keep trying it, see how it goes, and uh, we'll just go from there. So anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you don't watch us on Twitch, please start following watch us on YouTube. Please start subscribe and give it a thumbs up. You can also follow me on Twitter for reasons unknown. Um, I plan on being back hopefully sometime. I'm going to try and get there. Um, you know... I, I, my work schedule is completely upside down. 
Um, so we'll have to see when I can show up to live stream again. All right, everybody, thanks for watching. Everyone be safe out there. Eat some good food, drink some good beverage, spend time with your loved ones. This is a lot more important than hanging out with me, and I hope to see you all here uh, sometime soon. All right, everybody, peace.